Conception, Mary, my mother, live in me, act in me, speak in me and through me. Think your thoughts in my mind. Live love through my heart. Give me your dispositions and feelings. Teach, lead me, and guide me to Jesus. Correct, enlighten, and expand my thoughts and behavior. Possess my soul. Take over my entire personality and life. Replace it with yourself. Incline me to constant adoration. Pray in me and through me. Let me live in you and keep me in this union always. Queen of Peace, we give thanks with you to the Most High for your presence with us. Thank you for coming again today for us. We offer you this rosary, and like David with faith in his little stone, but much more powerful because we're, we're not using a stone. It's the rosary, the weapon. We consecrate the internet to your Immaculate Heart Mary, to you, Our Lady of Medjugorje, freed from Satan's seductions. May the whole world today come to know the beauty of your face and filled with the memory of heaven, experience the love of the Father, our Father. We, we have a Father. We make this consecration in union with St. Louis de Montfort, St. Maximilian Colby, St. Padre Pio, St. Andre Bisset, St. Faustina, the Secretary of God's Mercy, Father Slavko Barbarich, Brother Rene, the Saint of Gethsemane, the Little Flower, St. Teresa of Lisieux, her parents, Blessed Zelie and Louis Martin, Blessed Charles of Austria, St. Benedict, St. George, St. Rita, St. Clara chose me for 2012, St. Maria Goretti who chose Kathy for 2012, St. Charbel of Lebanon who chose Mary TV for 2012, 
Sister Lucia, Blessed Francesco, Jacinta of Fatima, Blessed Jacinta, who chose our rosary over the internet for 2012. Saint Joseph, foster father of us all, patron of family life, invoke your saint for 2012. We make this consecration of the internet to your Immaculate Heart Mary, to you, Our Lady of Medjugorje, in union with Blessed Mother Teresa of Calcutta, who wrote to us in her own hand, we are all praying one Hail Mary before Holy Mass to Our Lady of Medjugorje, and in union with your most beloved son, Blessed John Paul the Great, who wrote to his friends in Poland, I thank Sophia for everything concerning Medjugorje. I too go there every day as a pilgrim in my prayers. I unite in my prayers with all those who pray there or receive a call for prayer from there. Today we have understood this call better. I rejoice that our time is not lacking people of prayer and apostles. And understanding this call better, he later came to believe and said, Medjugorje is the spiritual center of the world. I ask for miracles in the lives of each person praying with us today, Mary. Remembering 21 years ago, you said to us, God sent me among you so that I can help you if you can grasp the rosary. Even a rosary alone can do miracles in the world and in your lives. I stay among you as long as it is God's will. And I thank you because your response is serving the good and peace. And I thank you that you do not betray my presence here. At the top of our list, each one of us, the only criteria to be part of this prayer group. It's so much fun, but there's one demand, and that is that at the top of each one of our lists, our first intention is that everything on Mary's heart, all her intentions, as she comes to Vitska Maria Ivan today, are granted to her. Miracles today for Mary. We're with you, we're looking at you, we love you, Blessed Mother. We pray as always through Christ our Lord, amen. amen. Just before we begin the rosary, today's Thursday. What do we do, especially on Thursday that Our Lady asked, and I believe in March 4th, 1984, she asked every Thursday. Mm -hmm. And what she meant then was every day that she gave a message, because it was on Thursdays that she was giving messages, until January 25th, 1987, when she started giving a message on the 25th of every month, because she said a certain part of my son has plan has been fulfilled on the 17th of January 87, she said that. Mm -hmm. Therefore, from now on, I'm going to be giving a message on the 25th of every month. Mm -hmm. And that first message of the 25th of January 1987, she asked us to pray for God has chosen each one of you in order to use you for the great plan of salvation of mankind. You cannot comprehend how great your role is in God's plan. Therefore, dear children, pray so that through prayer you might comprehend God's plan through you. I am with you so that you can realize it completely. She asked every, every time we got a message, and, and she said Thursdays because that was when she was giving messages back then. Matthew 6, 24 to 34. It should be drilled into us. Deuteronomy tells Jewish mothers and fathers, drill these things into your children. Well, our Jewish mother, the beautiful, blessed mother, the mother of Jesus, this passage, she, and it's the father who gave it to her because everything, she's in total union with the father. She does whatever he wants. Do whatever he tells you, Jesus Matthew 6, 24 to 34, that's the passage for us. You, you know, have... you can imagine that Our Lady lived this way if this is uh, something Jesus asks of us. Wow. He, he would have experienced it in his family life with Joseph and Mary. So, wow. So, um, you know, it came, it came to him not only because of uh, inspiration, but because of experience. Wow, this is how he lived as a little tiny guy. Mm -hmm. Wow, praise God. So J Joseph and Mary probably lived without anxiety, without anxiety about their life. 
We often, um, <clears throat> probably. I'm sure probably. they were tempted with anxiety. I'm sure there were things to worry about, but they always put them in the Father's hands. And, um, and, and I think Seek that's something to think about for us. Seek first the kingdom of God and, all, and his righteousness. What does that mean, and his righteousness? To be conformed to his, to him, instead of the world. Yeah, not, not, to, uh, not to live out maybe all the uh, um, disorder that we find in our families or around us, not to say yes to that, but to resist it and to be as righteous as we can, to forgive, to love, to put others' needs first, to pray all the time, to um, give to the poor, to sacrifice, all those things that the Father asked in the Old Testament and that Jesus again in the New <clears throat> reiterated with new depth, you know, that we need to live like the Father. Eat your bread with a joyful heart. Also be happy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And all these things shall be yours as well. No one can serve two masters. Matthew 6, 24 to 34. Oh boy, wait a minute. I don't even, haven't even looked, but I know I've got an email from Mary Jo. She's saying, wait a minute. It's a <laughs> message from Our Lady that we read Matthew 6, 24 to 34. Mm -hmm. She told us if, a month or two ago that we're forgetting to pray to be illuminated by the Holy Spirit to understand her messages, what the Father wants us to know through them. Mm -hmm. So let's ask the Holy Spirit to come and help us understand today what is for each one of us to discover in this passage from Scripture what's there for us mm -hmm. to set us free today. Name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, amen. Come Holy Spirit, fill the hearts of your faithful and kindle in them the fire of your love. Send forth your Spirit and they shall be created and you shall renew the face of the earth. O oh God, who by the light of the Holy Spirit did instruct the hearts of thy faithful, grant that by that same Holy Spirit we may be truly wise and ever rejoice in his consolation. Illuminate us so that we can understand what your spouse, our mother, the Queen of Peace, is saying to us through her messages. Through Christ our Lord, amen. amen. No one can serve two masters, for either he will hate the one and love the other, or he'll be devoted. Oh, Michael. Remember, I was going to do this. No one can serve two masters. For either he will hate the one. It's, it's right over here. Or either he will hate the one and love the other, or he'll be devoted to the one and despise the other. You cannot serve God and mammon. Oh my gosh, is that a word for us today when there's so much concern about money mm -hmm. and temptation to really love it. Mm -hmm. Mammon is the love of money. Mm -hmm. Therefore I tell you, do not be anxious about your life, what you shall eat or what you shall drink, nor about your body, what you shall put on. Is not life more than food and the body more than clothing? Look at the birds of the air. They neither sow nor reap nor gather into barns, and yet your heavenly Father feeds them. Are you not of more value than they? And which of you, by being anxious, can add one cubit to his span of life? And why are you anxious about clothing? Consider the lilies of the field, how they grow. They neither toil nor spin, yet I tell you, even Solomon in all his glory was not arrayed like one of these. But if God so clothes the grass of the field, which today is alive and tomorrow is thrown into the oven, will he not much more clothe you, O men of little faith? Therefore, do not be anxious, saying, What shall we eat? Or, What shall we drink? Or, What shall we wear? For the Gentiles seek all these things, and your Heavenly Father knows that you need them all. But seek first His kingdom and His righteousness, and all these things shall be yours as well. Therefore, do not be anxious about tomorrow, for tomorrow will be anxious for itself. Let the day's own trouble be sufficient for the day. Hmm. 
Wow. You know, we could uh, cons consider uh, continuing the reflection on Matthew 6, 24 to 34 by going into the rosary and thinking of all the mysteries of Jesus' life and how Our Lady would have lived that um, scripture in that mystery. It's very fruitful. She certainly wasn't concerned about herself. Wow. So today is uh, Thursday. Um, we're in the fourth week of Lent. We're getting close. <laughs> no, she wasn't. She certainly wasn't concerned about herself. Mm -hmm. Wow. And yet now, look, because of that, look what heaven has done. She's the focus of so much because she's a door to mm -hmm. Jesus. She she's, uh, brings heaven, yeah. the morning star. Yeah. Her beauty is so great. And it, that's tied into her not at all being concerned for herself. Yeah about herself. Yeah. Well, maybe she could help us have a little of that freedom. Mm -hmm. The first, well, let's begin. We didn't yet, did we? Um, no, we didn't. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended to the dead the third day he rose again. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From thence he shall come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria, Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. Um, Our Lady said in her March 20, and uh, I'm sorry, March 18th message through Mariana, she said, um, <laughs> come on, you guys. She said, um, I desire to be the bond between you and the Heavenly Father, your mediatrix. And uh, I've been thinking a lot about that bond between us and the Father, that we need to be bonded to the Father, and that she wants to be uh, a, a vehicle for that. She wants somehow to help us in that process of becoming bonded to him. And so then later in the message she says, my children, consecrate yourselves to me completely. And that really is part of the process of allowing her to bond us to the Father is by giving ourselves over to her. And um, so I, I was just thinking that t today we could um, maybe during this rosary just concentrate on being consecrated to her and bonded to her so that she can bond us to the Father somehow. It's, it's really a human, um, it's, it's part of our very fiber that we needed to be bonded. We need to be bonded not to God and to each other with love. That's our, one of our hearts, deepest heart's desire is to belong and to be, 
to be um, connected to each other and connected to God. And part of the family included, wanted, um, chosen. Uh, you know, all those words are part of that deep desire we have to be with God, in God, you know, living through him, everything done in him. That's the bonding. And Jesus, of course, was uh, God's gift to us to bring us back into that relationship. And Our Lady helps us to get into the heart of that process of Jesus bonding us to the Father. It's, um, it's God's way of saying, I'm choosing you again. I'm choosing you. I'm still choosing you through Jesus. I choose you. I want you. And uh, we need that so desperately. We need to experience that, that choice of God for us. Um, so, uh, as we pray this rosary, let's let that reality kind of flow into our hearts because we need it to continue on. We need it to be strong. We need it to be, to, to be good and to do as God asks. We need that uh, bonding to be active and alive in our hearts. Amen. Okay, let's do what you just said. And I can't think of any better way to do it than what you said in your report. Mm -hmm. Your reflection, excuse me, for today. Mm -hmm. What did you say? To, to really actively consecrate ourselves to Our Lady over the next few days before the Annunciation. And I'm sorry, I'm a simple guy, I need help. Mm -hmm. And what you gave is the best help I have. The only criticism, the only correction I'd give you in your reflection, I'd give you one. Do you know what it is? What? You said, and only because I know Mother Immaculata would say this, because mm -hmm. she told me. You said it was written by Mother Immaculata. She said it was written, it was given to her by Our Lady. Mm -hmm. It was written by Our Lady given to her, and Our Lady called it the Immaculate Conception Prayer. Mm -hmm. I, and boy, it's, it's, straight from, it's straight from heaven, wherever it came from. Mm -hmm. It's straight from heaven. That Immaculate Conception Prayer, that's what I want to pray. Let's pray it again between the, uh, this decade. I'm waiting for Michael to get back in here because I want to, well, let's, I wanted to go to this camera. Whoops. And I was gonna put up here the prayer. But you oh, know what? That's better. That's better. Let's just have her. Yep. Okay, let's. <laughs> The first, sorrowful mystery, oh, okay. the first sorrowful mystery of the agony in the garden, Mary bond us with the Father. Immaculate conception, you read it. Let's pray this with our heart. Immaculate conception, Mary, my mother, live in me, act in me, speak in me and through me. Think your thoughts in, in my mind, love through my heart, Give me your dispositions and feelings. Teach, lead me, and guide me to Jesus. Correct, enlighten, and expand my thoughts and behavior. Possess my soul. Take over my entire personality and life. Replace it with yourself. Incline me to constant adoration. Pray in me and through me. Let me live in you and keep me in this union always. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou 
thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. And blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive, forgive us, us our, our sins, sins. Save, save us from, from the fires of hell. hell. And lead all souls, souls to heaven, heaven especially, especially those in most need of thy mercy. mercy. Ave, ave, ave Maria. Ave, ave, ave Maria. Jesus was with Mary and for 30 years, then with his apostles for three. Mm -hmm. At the 30th year anniversary of her coming to Medjugorje, we all were anticipating, this is big, what is she going to say in her message? The first words out of her mouth on that day, June 25th, 2011. Dear children, give thanks with me to the Most High for... She's so thankful for it, just blurted out after 30 years. What, what, what is the word? What is it? You remember? Do you remember? Kathy, I know you do. Mm -hmm. For what? My presence. My presence with you. She's the glue. She's the glue. She's the glue. But notice what she said right after that. My heart is joyful watching the love and joy and the living of my messages. Many of you responded, but I wait for and seek all the hearts that have fallen asleep to awaken from the sleep of unbelief. Little children, draw even closer to my Immaculate Heart. Little children, draw even closer to my Immaculate Heart so that I can lead all of you toward eternity. The second sorrowful mystery, the scourging at the pillar. Um, well, all I have to say is think, you know, in that consecration we say, love through my heart, give me your dispositions and feelings. Uh, and I think that right now at the scourging, we, w we would really want Our Lady's feelings to help understand what's happening through Jesus and to Jesus. Um, to, to receive her feelings at that moment and to just uh, live in that suffering with her. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. 
Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins. Save us, Save us from, from the, the fires, fires of hell. hell. And lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria, Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. The third sorrowful mystery of the crowning with thorns. How about picking a message, Mom? December 4th, 1986. Dear children, today I call you to prepare your hearts for these days when the Lord particularly desires to purify you from all the sins of your past. You, dear children, are not able to buy yourself able to, but able by yourself. Therefore, I am here to help you. You pray, dear children, only that way shall you be able to recognize all the evil that is in you and surrender it to the Lord so that the Lord may completely purify your hearts. Therefore, dear children, pray without ceasing and prepare your hearts in penance and fasting. Thank you for having responded to my call. Wow, it's that was given for Advent, but it's perfect for Lent. Oh. And uh, it, for me, it has particular resonance because this weekend I'm going to take part in a small seminar about healing of the family tree. And I, I'm praying for my family and for all of my sins and all the ways that our ancestors may have created sinful patterns in our family. And I do think that um, you know this is a time to recognize the evil and and uh, purify ourselves, get rid of it. Just get rid of it, and Our Lady will help us. She said, she said here, um, you, dear children, are not able by yourselves, therefore I am here to help you. So, um, and I, I know for a fact I can't do it by myself. So to know that she's here to help us, wow, that really gives me, 
look at what it's showing. <laughs> what? Isn't it no tape? It shows no, no tape. Poor. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. It's not. It's just a, mm. Anyway, so so we can um, we can ask her to help us in this process, and we really do need that help. So the third sorrowful mystery, the. Um, That's what you're going there for to get the tape erased. Yeah. <laughs> we want all that off the tape. <laughs> okay. Yeah. It's something. Uh, yeah. I think it was. It, but it was when. It's when you missed with that camera over there. Well, let's go to number two and then we'll figure it out. No? Okay, wait. Wait, okay. Okay, let's, let's just set everything aside, <laughs> get back to. Uh, that's what Mariana, I learned from Mariana. She said when she gets distracted by her own thoughts or worries or concerns during the rosary, she just stops and she just gives it to Our Lady, discusses it with Our Lady, gives it to her, and then goes back to the rosary. Okay, let's, we're dealing with this little thing on the screen right now. We <laughs> don't know why it's there. But now we're going to set it aside. We're going to leave it in Michael's hands, and we're going to pray. It's your turn. What decade are we the on? The third sorrowful mystery, the crowning of the Lord. Praise Jesus. Our Father, who art in heaven. You know, I was thinking, I don't know what this means, but what I was thinking of is the crowning with thorns. You Sometimes Michael will put the, uh, will have the camera on Jesus being crowned with thorns. And now it's up close. Our Lady. Don't touch anything. Our Lady is crowned with this beautiful crown of 12 stars. Sorry. Okay. Somehow, not only Our Lady, but all her other children, God wants to give us a beautiful crown, won by the crown of thorns of Jesus. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. And blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the <laughs> Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Go <laughs> back. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world, world without, without end. end. Amen. Amen. 
Oh my Two. Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, <laughs> and lead all souls to heaven, especially those, those in, in most need, need of thy mercy. mercy. <laughs> Ave, Ave, Ave Maria, Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. Well, Mary, we want to live Matthew 6, 24 to 34 today at a new level, a new freedom. Oh, boy, the picture you get there is to be adhered to the Father. Mm -hmm. Not, and there'd be no space where any anxiety or anything can come in. Adhered to the Father. And it happens, the super glue is Mary. She's the one who's doing it and being offered to, to us from heaven now. The Immaculate Conception, this is the fourth, the carrying the cross. Immaculate Conception, Mary, my mother, live in me, act in me, speak in me and through me. Think your thoughts in my mind, love through my heart. Give me your dispositions and feelings. Teach, lead me and guide me to Jesus. Correct, enlighten, and expand my thoughts and behavior. Possess my soul. Take over my entire personality and life. Replace it with yourself. Incline me to constant adoration. Pray in me and through me. Let me live in you and keep me in this union always. The carrying of the cross. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins. Save us, Save us from, from the, the fires, fires of hell. hell. And, and lead, lead all, all souls, souls to heaven, heaven especially those in most need of thy mercy. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria, Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. The fifth and last sorrowful mystery, the crucifixion, the death of Jesus.
I'm told that Our Lady, when asked uh, when was the most joyful moment in her life, she said the most joyful moment was the same as the most suffering, the most hard, terrible moment. And it was at the foot of the cross with Jesus' crucifixion. Very, very hard for me to understand, mm -hmm. except what you've been saying, Kathy, Our Lady is the glue. She's, the, she's her Immaculate Conception prayer. That's what you gave in your reflection today. Mm -hmm. She told us to be consecrated to her mm -hmm. in her latest message. Therefore, what does she say that? My children, consecrate yourselves to me completely. Boy, it's right after she said, I desire to take you by the hand and to walk with you in the battle mm -hmm. against the impure spirit. Mm -hmm. My children, consecrate yourselves to me completely. Mm -hmm. We'll get blown away if that's not the case. And she's so adhered to the will of the Father. Mm -hmm. She's so in union with the will of the Father. And that's what we want and we'll have it through her. Mm -hmm. Mary, we want to be consecrated to you completely. Hold nothing back. We're weak and we are sinful. You weren't sinful. Help us, Mary. I desire to take you by the hand and to walk with you. Take us by the hand today. The crucifixion, the death of Jesus. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. And forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive, forgive us, us our sins, sins save, save us from, from the fires of hell, hell and lead all souls to heaven, heaven especially, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria, Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother, Mother of, of mercy, mercy, our life, our, life, our sweetness, and our hope. hope. To thee do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To thee do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious advocate, thine eyes of mercy toward us. 
and after this our exiles show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. St. Michael the Archangel, defend, defend us in battle. Be our protection against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray. And do thou, O Prince of the Heavenly Host, by the power of God, thrust into hell Satan and all evil spirits who prowl about the world seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. Remember, O most gracious Virgin Mary, that never was it known that anyone who fled to thy protection employed thy help or sought thy intercession was left unaided. Inspired by this confidence, I fly unto thee, O Virgin of virgins, my mother. To thee do I come, before thee I stand, sinful and sorrowful. O Mother of the Word incarnate, despise not my petitions, but in thy mercy hear and answer me. Amen. Eternal Father, I offer thee the body and blood, soul and divinity, of that dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ. In atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. Holy God, holy omnipotent, holy immortal. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. Holy God, Holy Omnipotent, Holy Immortal. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. Holy God, Holy Omnipotent, Holy Immortal. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. Jesus, I trust in you. 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 Sacred Heart of Jesus. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. Jesus, I trust. Jesus, I trust in you. Jesus, I trust in you. Sacred Heart of Jesus. Have mercy on Immaculate us. Immaculate Heart of Mary. Pray for us. All the angels of Medjugorje. Protect us. All angels and saints. Pray for us. <laughs> now this is what we have right in front of us as we pray, and this is uh, Our Lady of the Camera. What's what's her name? <laughs> Our Lady of the New Media. Of the New Media. Our Lady of the New Media. Praise God. Yeah. There she is. Wow. Well, we can do our healing of the family tree prayer. Okay. And hey, we've seen some healing today. Yeah. We've seen some of the effect of this prayer today. Look at this. We're gonna have. We, we, we started the rosary earlier. We're gonna end earlier. Maybe. We spent more time in prayer and not me talking. <laughs> this is. Is this a sign of the Holy Spirit or I not? Hope, I hope so. It'll take a. It took a. It'll, it would take a miracle. <laughs> well, you could still blow it. <laughs> Heavenly Father, I come before you as your child in great need of your help. I have physical health needs, emotional needs, spiritual needs, and interpersonal needs. Many of my problems have been caused by my own failures, neglect, and sinfulness, for which I humbly beg your forgiveness, Lord. But I also ask you to forgive the sins of my ancestors whose failures have left their effects on me in the form of unwanted tendencies, behavior patterns, and defects in body, mind, and spirit. Heal me, Lord, of all these disorders. With your help, I sincerely forgive everyone, especially living or dead members of my family tree, who have directly offended me or my loved ones in any way, or those whose sins have resulted in their present sufferings and disorders. In the name of your divine Son, Jesus, and the power of his Holy Spirit, I ask you, Father, to deliver me and my entire family tree from the influence of the evil one. That's what we're doing with this prayer. We're calling um, the grace on the other side of, the, uh, of Mary. She's inviting us to come. This was the last apparition of Fatima, 
I think in 27, to 1927, Our Lady appeared to Lucia. Though, from what I understand, it, I think she appeared to her a lot. But th she had a message there. And it, look, Our Lady looks like Medjugorje with her hand extended, like a, the Lady of Medjugorje inviting us to come. Underneath the other arm of Jesus. And what does the word say? Grace and mercy. And that's what we're doing. We're going there and invoking that, bringing our ancestors, our children, our families, our mothers, our grandparents, our fathers, our grandfathers, our great-grandfathers, our great-great-great-grandfathers, and all the beauty and junk of our, of our past, in our genealogical past. We're bringing all that now under the cross to receive grace and mercy. That's really happening with this prayer. I ask you, Father, to deliver me and my entire family tree from the influence of the evil one. Free all living and dead members of my family tree, including those in adoptive relationships and those in extended family relationships, from every contaminating form of bondage. Our prayer can even go back right now and have an effect. By your loving concern for us, Heavenly Father, and by the shed blood of your precious Son, Jesus, I beg you to extend your blessing to me and to all my living and deceased relatives. Heal every negative effect transmitted through all past generations and prevent such negative effects in future generations of my family tree. I symbolically place the cross of Jesus over the head of each person in my family tree and between each generation. I ask you to let the cleansing blood of Jesus purify the bloodlines in my family lineage. Set your protective angels to encamp around us. And permit Archangel Raphael, the patron of healing, to administer your divine... I'm telling him to go to that camera over there. <laughs> Sorry. Hey, how come it doesn't work over here, Mike? Because he said number four. Okay, set, let's, okay, we stop. <laughs> Go back to the prayer. Set your protective angels to encamp around us and permit Archangel Raphael, the patron of healing, to administer your divine healing power to all of us, even in areas of genetic disability. Give special power to our family members' guardian angels to heal, protect, guide, and encourage each of us in all our needs. Let your healing power be released at this very moment and let it continue as long as your sovereignty permits. And I invoke the presence of Our Lady today in Medjugorje to be over each one of us, to be with each one of us and every member of our family and our entire family tree, living and deceased. And we meditate on the wounds of Jesus so that we can be healed of our wounds due to our sins and the sins of our parents. That was Our Lady's message in March 25, 1997, to do that, to hold a cross and do that, say that pray that. Boy, Our Lady's message from Medjugorje, she called for this generational healing stuff. Mm -hmm. In our family tree, Lord, we place all bondage with the holy bonding and family love, and let there be an ever deeper bonding with you, Lord, by the Holy Spirit to your Son, Jesus. Let the family of the Holy Trinity pervade our family with its tender, warm, loving presence, so that our family may recognize and manifest that love in all our relationships. All of our unknown needs we include with this petition that we pray in Jesus' precious name. Amen. St. Joseph, patron of family life. Pray for us. Foster father of us all. St. Charbo, uh, the saint for Mary TV this year. Pray for us. Pray for us. Mary, Queen of Peace, our mother. Pray for us. I invoke the presence of Our Lady today in Medjugorje to be with Pope Benedict the Sixteenth. And, and that her mantle cover him and protect him from all his enemies, both wolves and sheep's clothing within the church, and enemies to the cross of Christ without. And we intercede for his intentions today and call for his protection. 
Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be for, and will be forever. Amen. <laughs> we, this consecration, the consecration, consecrate to her completely. She asked for the other day in her message. Completely, I will take your lives into my motherly hands. That's the only way to witness. The right way to witness my son in the right way through my motherly heart, this consecration. It's important to be a witness Jesus to the world. Mary's a key for it today to happen in our consecration to her. And her last sentence, pray for your shepherds that united in my son, they can always joyful, joyfully proclaim the word of God. She just called March 18th. We pray for all our shepherds now with gratitude and ask your mantle to be over them, protect them, and to bless them. Mary, that they can always joyfully proclaim, proclaim the word of God in season and out of season, when it's easy, when it's hard. And it looks like the storm clouds are, it's going to be some in the world are facing martyrdom right now. Strengthen. We ask for strength for our shepherds, your mantle over them. Mary, come. Mother, come. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We pray for all of you. Mary, we know we don't need to remind you, but it gives us joy to repeat your message. January 25th, 25, January 25th 1991, you said, if you can grasp the rosary, even a rosary alone can do miracles in the world and in your lives. Kathy and I ask for miracles today in the lives of all those who have prayed with us, live right now or later today or this week in the archives. Miracles today, Mary. We love you. We trust you. We rejoice with you, Mary, our mother. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Mary, Queen of Peace, pray for us. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. Amen. I'll put it back up. You will? Yeah. You hate to see me contort and twist. And <laughs> Thank you, that's kind of you. Mm -hmm. Well, it's kind of you to be praying with us, too. We are very happy that you're there. Yes, we are. Hey, do you like my little dashboard here? <laughs> I, uh, Kathy said, you can't do that, because I've had that rock there. I said, but the, yesterday you said it looked like chrysobots. <laughs> so that's our little chrysobots. This is the stone on which Father Slavko Barbarich died and went to heaven. Wow, praise God, how exciting. Is you know, he, ne he always, even when we were having disagreements and stuff, he always said yes to cameras in the church. If he could get away with it, he would always, he understood this technology stuff and how important it was. What a great intercessor we have in Father Slavko Barbarich. You talk about shepherds. There he was, Medjugorje, between the devil and the deep blue sea. The, the enemy was just trying to destroy Medjugorje. And there was Father Slavko, a shepherd, to the pilgrims, to the parish. Yeah. to Medjugorje. Oh, thank you, Father Slavko. Come and intercede for us. Be with us all today, all of us, as we continue to sail on the digital sea in the refuge of Mary's Immaculate Heart. We won't be here on the computer, but we're going to be together with Mary sailing all day long today in the refuge of Immaculate Heart and just singing, singing, singing. <laughs> okay. I'll sing. Well, you know what I just realized? As you said, you could still blow it. It looks like I am, so we better quit. <laughs> All right. God bless everyone. We'll see you tomorrow.